So behind me we have the Sustainability Action Team from Roxburgh Prize Primary School. Uh, one of the things we try and make the effort to do every term or a couple of times a term is we come to Tiffany Cruz Reserve here and try and clean up the lake. We're very proud of it, we're actually a five star sustainable school so this is one of the many things that we try and do in terms of uh, waste minimisation. Here's the pile of stuff that's coming from McDonald's. Here's the stuff that's coming from like, sorting out into brand names and see which brand names are the children to find, who's producing the most rubbish. We filled up just about seven bags just in that exact spot. Also, you have to bring containers, not plastic bags, because they can fly easily. They go in the water and kill lots of animals in there. What we can do is we can bring containers to school. We can also recycle them. And it takes a thousand years to destroy plastic, so we better think twice before littering and using plastic. Plastic in soil makes the uh, water in the soil uh, polluted, which, which affects the photosynthesis in uh, plants. Our parents and our grandparents uh, protected these things to us. We should protect these things for our younger generations. Animals have uh, uh, ruled the earth for a long time, and if we destroy these things, we won't rule uh, the world for a long time. We will destroy it. We will be the destroyers. Wasting is unsafe and not to waste anymore. I know most of you won't listen to this, but if you think about it, and you listen to me, it will actually change the world. And in 10 years or so, the world is not going to be as good as it used to be. We only have one planet and one planet only, and we have to take care of this planet for all our must. I love this planet.